Welcome again to another LumaFusion video and free download. Please leave a like and a comment so I can continue to bring you more new content. In this video I'll be showing how to download and use my new film strip overlay. The download link will be displayed within the video, so stick around. Let's begin by taking a look at a few examples. The film strip holds up to 6 clips or screenshots. It can be used as an overlay for another video or on its own. The background is transparent, so no chroma keys needed. Ok let's jump into the tutorial. Start by downloading the film reel project package. Once it's downloaded, open in, or select send to LumaFusion so it shows in your project list. The template is made up of 5 video timelines, with the 6th used for the film overlay. The duration for the template and keyframes have been set to produce a 15 seconds clip. Choose a clip from your library. Make sure you're happy with the start point and it's 15 seconds or longer. Drag it down from the preview window and place it over the start of a clip on the timeline. Make sure the original clip has a yellow border around it, as this indicates it will replace the clip. A box will pop up and you need to select the option to replace the clip, and keep the timeline duration. This has now been placed in one of the film reel windows. No need to resize or change keyframes. Follow the same process for the remaining clips to create your film reel. The top two clips have been split. This is because they are only seen for a very short duration, at the beginning and the end of the strip. You can color correct and make size adjustments in the edit screen for each clip as normal. Just don't forget to adjust the cropping areas if you adjust the size. Once you're happy you can change the background color in the settings menu. Export the clip to photos and it's ready to add into your main project. If you want to add a photo, video background or title frame text like in the example, export the video and add it to a new project. Edit the clip and crop the top and bottom of the video, or even try mixing it up and make it slightly opaque. Add it on top of your selected background video or picture, and add your title frame on the timeline above. That's it for this video. Feel free to ask any questions, and don't forget to drop a link to your video in the comments so I can see how your film strips turn out. Until next time, keep safe.